Hello and welcome back to my craft room. Well, I've had two unexpected pieces of happy mail this morning. Um, one was a lovely piece of stitchery from Sylvia, who um, we weren't even hadn't even agreed to do a stitchery swap, but she sent me a beautiful square anyway. Then I've got this parcel from. Um, I know this is. I can tell by the by the washi tape, and from the address, the return address, that it's from Kerry. So you'll know her as Kerry Ann in our in our Discord community. She's also in the Facebook group. A Kerry Alcock in the fa in the Facebook group. So we're doing the art swap, but I've already had the art swap from her. So I don't know what this is. This is a, a completely unexpected bonus. So let's get in and have a look. I'm just going to cut the um, bag open first because I can't show you that because it's got my address on one side and hers on the other. Oh. oh, I think I'm going to be um, going to be needing my tissues in a minute. <laughs> oh God, there we go. And just make sure there's no addresses. No. <laughs> so she's saying, excuse the packing, trying to protect the contents. I can't believe this. To Annie and Tom, Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Please find enclosed. Oh, prompts Annie portrait and Tom portrait. I thought you both would like them. Oh, oh. oh now I don't know where to open this or save it for Christmas. I think I'm gonna open it. I think I'm gonna open it. Oh Carrie, that is so sweet of you. So the poor the prompts. This is for Artie Fartober. I'm still finishing my Artie Fartober. Where's my sketchbook? Is it within reach? No, it's buried. <laughs> I've still got a couple more to go and one of the ones I still haven't done is the portrait of Tom been putting it off I don't know I've got a, I've got a thing about it now so that's that's what she's talking about there I think I'm going to go ahead and open it I don't think I can wait now because I want you all to I want to share this this with you all and um, you're not going to be there when I'm opening presents on Christmas morning are you so oh, Kerry this is so sweet of you she also has such lovely washi tapes as well. I'm hoping I'm going to be able to do something arty farty with all the washi tape that I've been collecting up over the course of the swaps. And my card enclosed. I hope you like it. I know I like it. Keeping myself in suspense to go into the parcel. I do, I do. Should I save it and open Christmas morning with Tom? No, I want to share it with you all. Oh wow, look at that. I love it. And she's used some of this. She sent me some of this gorgeous. She she watercolours this cuddy paper and uh, she sent me some sheets of it that she's done. It's beautiful and she's done uh, she's done some die cutting with that. That's lovely. How cute is that? I haven't had many Christmas cards this year. I've sort of um cut back on them a lot actually. Ah. Oh. Uh, Zoe and Felicity are artists as well. It obviously runs in the family very much so. So let's have a look. Shall we go in? Shall we go in? <laughs> Maybe I should message her on Discord and say, are you okay for me to open it now or do you want me to wait for Christmas? Let's go in. Let's go in. Oh, oh no, she said something about this too. Hang on, then put that to one side. What did she say about this now? I've forgotten. A little love heart my sister Samantha made a few years ago. Oh, look. How cute. How cute is that? I'm going to hang that on my little Christmas tree. I have a, I have strange things. on my. We don't have a traditional Christmas tree. It's just a little white branch thing. We bought two, two little mini white branch things this year because the one I made myself was getting a bit decrepit. And I hang all sorts of things. I found this on the street and I thought it was adorable. So that'll get hung on the tree as well. So this, oh, how lovely. Thank you so much. Now this one, I I have shown you this one before on this channel because I printed it off in my in my sketchbook. I printed off all the portraits of Annie and stuck them in the page for that, for that um, prompt. Look at this, sort of Andy Warhol inspired. <laughs> many versions of me I love it I just love that I love how she's used my logo thing in some of them and then the face that it was taken from in others it's just brilliant I really I really love that I'll keep it with my arty fartober 
sketchbook that's what i'll do because it will fit in there nicely I really do need to f oh there it is <sighs> oh look the colors and everything yeah i'll keep them together so in my um um can't find it now <laughs> my, my page for that hang on where is it here it is. Yeah, look, I've got it printed off there, a photo of it. Um, I printed off some of my, and actually there were more than this that I saw after, after I put this. So I need to go through, find them again, print them out and stick them in there because my portrait of Annie <laughs> wouldn't fit. It was, um, here's my little, this was my portrait of Annie. <laughs> it was done with, it was um, painted paper that I sort of stitched into and stuff. Yeah, yeah quite enjoyed doing that but of course it wouldn't fit in the book so <laughs> oh how lovely to have this I'll, stay, I'll put it up behind me for a while you can see uh, Hannah sent me the portrait of any version as well you can see it just there I don't know how well you can see it and um, Rachel did a, a, a a picture of me as well and Gabby did one of me and Tom as well maybe I should put a whole book just with <laughs> portraits people have done of me and Tom <laughs> that could be quite fun actually okay that's lovely cool I could almost use that as the as the cover of my book couldn't I beautiful absolutely beautiful and here's the one of Tom <laughs> look at this <laughs> oh. <laughs> I love it day 20. 5, 26, 24, 24, 25, 26, 27. Now I can't now. What were, let's have a look at what the prompts were again. Because there's obviously, I think, I think it might have been cryptid cap, capers and dragonfly in there. And maybe under the sea. So she's combined all of those prompts into one. Let me have a look. 24. 24 was the picture of Tom. 25 was under the sea. 26 was dragonfly. Oh, and 27 was Hobbit home. There we go. So <laughs> we'll see. Because Tom always calls me. You'll know if you're in our Discord. Tom always calls me the Hobbit. Something to do with being short and having hairy toes. <laughs> so this is this is Tom. And clearly he's, he's visiting me, I reckon. <laughs> see, now that is under the... It, I would have thought this would fit cryptic capers. As a, or dragon. Dragon was another one. Of, where was... 23 was the dragon prompt so yeah maybe maybe that's actually five prompts in one anyway it's absolutely beautiful and very um typical of kerry's style but i absolutely love it and it really has caught <laughs> caught the way tom it's really caught tom <laughs> i just love that it's really really special to have that to keep myself i think what i'm gonna do with these um, pieces art pieces that people have sent me i think i'm gonna make like a um like a portfolio like a, like a like a mini colorful version of, of the big kind of portfolios that we used to carry back and forth to art school years ago and um and i can put my art swaps in there as well maybe just something it's like with the stitch there's just something very special about you know you can see photos on screen but there's something very special about having someone's original piece of art or stitching or anything they've made in in your hands it's just yeah it's just so special i feel really Ooh, set myself off again now. <laughs> I, will, I will set myself off. I'm going to stop now before I um, before I go stupid again. Um, I hope you enjoyed that a little peek at my excitement <laughs> for the day, and um, I will see you again really, really soon. Bye. <laughs> I spoil. I'm like a spoilt child. <laughs>